All right, let's do this thing. Hey, folks. Welcome to Sunday morning. This is the show where I play things that I want to play. Um, probably things that are old and um, old classics that I haven't gotten to yet. That's our theme so far, but this is only our second game, so we're not allowed to have a real theme yet. We'll see. Um, we're talking in chat at the moment about getting rid of cable TV and, like, if that makes a difference in your life. Because it's very expensive, and we've been meaning to cancel ours for a while, and jet lag is apparently canceling hers. Um, and there's, a, there's, like, a couple shows that I like having on cable. Um, but for the most part, that I like DVR... Um, but for the most part, I can get those online, too. Like, I could find them on Hulu or on their various websites for their, um, for their channels. And so, like, it seems silly to pay, you know, an extra, whatever, 80 or 100 bucks a month for something that you don't need. Um, and Evil Oatmeal was talking about, uh, this idea of, like, identifying all the media in your life that you could do without. Which made me think of Walden. Um, and if anybody out there hasn't read Walden, uh, God, what's the full title of that? Something about going into the woods, um, which is by Thoreau, Henry David Thoreau. Um, uh, yes, Walden. That's the one I'm talking about. Walden, co semicolon, or a life in the, w life in the woods. That's what it's called. Walden or life in the woods. Um. And I highly recommend reading this because it's a it's a really interesting book and even though it's it's aged a bit now, like Thoreau was kind of snarky. He was kind of a snarky ass and there's some of it's like actually kind of really funny. Uh but the basic gist of that was he was trying to identify just what are all the things in life we can do without period. Like, what's the absolute minimum necessary to, like, sustain daily functioning such that I can spend all of my time, like, thinking and writing and just enjoying the world and feeling inspired. That was his goal. It was It was like a scientific experiment for him. Semi, semi-scientific. Perhaps pseudo-scientific. But it was an experiment for him of, like, how much can I cut out of my life because he had this feeling that, like, we do a lot of things in our lives just to perpetuate um, having stuff. And then we end up having to do a lot more work to maintain the stuff that we have. So his thought was, like, let's just completely cut it out altogether. Um, and he, I don't know, it's, it was sort of an interesting experiment. He wrote, a, he wrote his book all about all the things he did. And, uh, and it's a good book. And I've read it, like... Uh, four or five times, something like that, because uh, I was working on um, the Walden Game Project uh, with Tracy Fullerton at the uh, at the USC Game Lab back, back when I was in grad school. Um, and so I did, <laughs> I had to read it a bunch for, for reference stuff and to look stuff up. Um, yeah, no, I, I understand, <laughs> Evil Oatmeal, that your motives are, are probably different than throws. But I still I still recommend the book. It's a fun read. Uh, I enjoy it. Um, I just noticed my door's open and my husband's still asleep, so let me close the door <laughs> real quick. Just a sec. He works night shifts, so I don't want to wake him up while he is still sleeping um because that seems because he needs as much as much sleep as he can get um all right so where were we when we last played this game i know we were in the mountains i remember we did a bunch of stuff with mummies and we got a crazy screaming mirror shield uh and we can use that to get more quickly into the castle now i guess and I think I have to go bomb a thing in the ceiling, and then get back. Yeah, okay. I sort of remember where we are. Let's let's get back into it. 
That's a good goal, Evil Oatmeal. Evil Oatmeal says, My goal is not to rid myself of anything unnecessary, per se, but rather to more effectively exercise my power as a consumer. That is also... That is a noble goal. That is a totally valid goal. Alright. This game... Turn the sound back on. Alright. Oh, no. Please tell me I didn't... Ah, shoot. Uh, this is the worst. I did that whole intro. And now I'm gonna have to leave you guys behind. I think. Because I'm pretty sure my emulator does not work uh, if I plug it in after... If I plug in my controller... Rather, my controller does not work if I plug it in after I've started the emulator. Let's double check. Yeah, okay. <laughs> I'm gonna have to... Maybe I'll keep streaming. We'll see how this works. I'm gonna have to... No, but I can't because the emulator is gonna do the weird graphical glitch if I restart it. Let's try this. I'm gonna stop the emulator, and just in case, I'm gonna try restarting directly now. But probably, I will get the graphical glitch if I do that in this order. So I'm probably going to have to stop the stream and restart it. Let's check here. Yeah, see that? Okay, that's what happens when I start the emulator second. Okay, I'll be right back, you guys. <laughs> Sorry about this. BRB.